right, um, Rosa Parks. Okay, Rosa Parks was born on February 4, 1913 in Pinevale, Alabama, and she was the eldest of two children. Um, growing up, Rosa Parks was exposed to the reality of segregation. Unlike most African American girls who went no further than sixth grade in school, Rosa attended the Alabama State Teachers College High School. But she had to drop out because her mother and her grandmother's illness. Um, a, few a few years later, Rosa met Raymond Parks at the age of 19, and they were married in 1932. After their marriage in 1932, she earned her high school diploma. Um, on December 1st, 1955, as Rosa was going home from work on the bus, her and three other black passengers were told to give up their seats to a white male passenger. But, of course, she refused, and she was arrested. An all-day bus boycott was organized on the day of Rosa's trial on December 5, 1955, where she was fined $14 and found guilty. Thousands of people walked, carpooled, and took cabs to work. The boycott lasted 381 days, with Reverend jo Martin Luther King Jr. as their leader. Rosa became the face of the Montgomery bus boycott. Um, in 1956, the Supreme Court decision supported the civil rights position calling for an end to racial segregation. Uh, un unable to find work, largely due to her political stance, the Parks moved north to Detroit, Michigan. In 1965, Rosa was working for Congressman John Conyers and retired in 1988. In her vision for a better tomorrow, Rosa co-founded the Rosa and Raymond Parks Institute for Self-Development, which educates young people on the civil rights movement and provides youth with professional guidance. Rosa Parks passed away on October 24, 2005, but in her lifetime, she received over two dozen honorary doctorates and numerous national and international awards among them, the Medal of Freedom from President Clinton. Although she never planned on getting arrested, her simple action changed the course of the nation. The end.